Hi, I'm Bob Berner from Pluggable Technologies. In previous videos, I've gone over basic multi-monitor setup, configuration, and some basic troubleshooting. In this video, I'd like to show you a handy trick on how to change the configuration of your displays quickly with just a few key presses. So, in our previous videos, I've shown that typically the way to make changes to your display setup is to right-click on an empty spot of your desktop and then select Display Settings. Here you can change spatial orientation, whether or not you're in extend or duplicate mode, resolution, what have you. But let's say I just need to make a quick, simple change. For example, right now I have my external monitor configured in extend mode. It is, it is an extension of my desktop. It's not a duplication. So instead of doing the display settings app, I can use the Windows presentation mode shortcut. And the way you access that is you press the Windows key on your keyboard, the one with the Microsoft logo, and then the P key, P is in Paul. And you can see what it does is it brings up this little picker that shows me my current configuration, that is, I'm in extend mode, and allows me to change it to duplicate just by clicking like so. That's pretty much it. Okay, let's say I want to switch back to extend mode. I can just as easily click back, extend, and I'm back to the way I was originally. Now, there's a couple other options here. One of them says PC screen only and second screen only. Now, what are they and why would they be useful? Well, let's say I was going to give a PowerPoint presentation. And instead of an external monitor, this was a projector. I'm just about ready to start, but then realize I need to make a change in my presentation. Rather than unhooking everything to make sure that people couldn't see what I was doing, I could just do PC screen only, make the change on my PowerPoint. You can see that the display is now turned off, or in this case, it would be the projector. Once I'm done making my change, I can go back to do either extend or duplicate and I'm ready to go. All right, so that's pretty easy, but it can get even easier. Let's say I don't even want to use the mouse or the trackpad. What I can do, and I'll show you this, let me click somewhere on my desktop to get rid of the picker. You can actually do this just with the keyboard alone. If I do Windows P and keep the Windows key held down, every time I press P, you can see the little selection box moves to different options. So if I have the white highlight over duplicate and then let go of the Windows key, Windows interprets that as me saying, I want to pick that option, and it just does it. And again, if I want to get rid of the box, I could click somewhere on the desktop, or I can even just hit the Escape key on my keyboard, and it goes away. So again, real quick overview, using Windows P, you can quickly change from duplicate to extend to PC screen only modes. And you can even do so just by using the keyboard and not even using the mouse. Hopefully you find that useful, and thank you for watching.